If you are a Windows PC or MacBook user, you will be using Microsoft Office all the time and uh, it is okay to have a Microsoft Office copy on PC but it is quite rare to have Microsoft Office copy without paying any money on MacBook. So in this video, I'll be showing you how you can get Microsoft Office 365 completely free without paying anything. And if you are a student, that is a plus. And if you're not a student, you can still use Microsoft Office completely free. So let's go to the MacBook screen and see how we can do that. Remember this method to get Office 365 or commonly known as Microsoft Office is completely free. First of all, you need to go to Microsoft365.com and here you will see three different options. If you have an account, you can directly sign in and if you don't have an account, you can sign up here. And if you want to see the subscription method here, these are in Renman B, but around 100 bucks in dollars it is offering for one year and monthly basis but here we are talking about completely free so let's close this one and here i'm logged in to microsoft account and here you can see a lot of different options it includes everything from word excel powerpoint outlook and onedrive and in the meantime one note so how can we use it as a completely free software to edit your office work and whatsoever you are doing? First, we are gonna take a look and here in the home section, we are gonna upload a file. The file has been uploaded. Now you can edit and use all the office functionality here. For example, I wanna enter here and insert any table, for example, like this. And the table has been inserted remember you must be having an internet connection to deal with this office if you have internet and once you did all the editing in your word document excel or every document related to microsoft office then you go to file then save as and here you can download a copy to your computer or simply save it as in your onedrive let's say i want to save to my computer and I can download a copy or simply email this link and we can work as a team. I'm gonna save it to my computer and here you can see the file has been downloaded. And if I open this one now, because I have already installed Microsoft Office on my Mac and it will look like this. Whatever the changes we made, this document are already saved. And if you wanna save to your drive here, you can simply save as and save as to your drive instead of saving to your computer. This was the method number one and it works for almost every tool like Microsoft Word, Excel and PowerPoint. And this method we described about uploading a document. But what if you want to create a new document? Let's say I want to create a new PowerPoint and here I can go to PowerPoint and here I can see some diamond options as well. These are for the premium method Stay in this video because in the end if you are a teacher or a student I'm going to teach you how you can get this one completely free for unlimited time. Okay, so once you're here in PowerPoint, you can go to a blank document and here you can create your presentation and it has almost all the tools you need to create a presentation or if you are doing anything uh, related to Excel or Microsoft Word. So once you are done with your presentation or once you are done with your Microsoft Excel data sheet, you can simply go to file and once again save as and download a copy to your computer or simply convert it into PDF or simply save it in your drive. I'm gonna download this one to my computer. Here you see that the download has been completed. Now if I go to my computer, here is the presentation. I just made a blank presentation. There is nothing inside. And if you do editing, it will show in the presentation there. Look, we didn't create anything, but the document we saved is already here now if you are a student how can you get it completely free I'll provide this link in the description you can just directly go to the link here is the link on this link if you are a teacher or a professor or a student with an official email official email is one that includes the university name let's say this is my official email and I click get started here you can choose 
if you are a teacher or a student i'm a student so i chose student now you can fill this form once you set your passcode then you have entered the email go to your email box and here is your code copy this one now paste this one here and you can choose the country i can select united states click on start now i'm gonna save this information here boom here you go here you got office 365 as a student because i am a student so i can do access all these features and here is my account now you can explore the apps now if i go to powerpoint let's say and there is no premium option or template given here i can use any premium template because i am a student so i logged in with the student id and in the meantime i can download offline apps once you log in with your student account then you will go to apps and here you will find all the apps and here i can download for ios or android i can click on ios app and get the microsoft office 365 mobile app and i can open my phone and scan this one from my phone here here on your phone right now you are signing with the same email and now you can use all the pro features completely free as a student you can create a new document scan a document or use all the microsoft office functionality once you sign in as a student or a teacher you will find all the apps here then you will have access to all these features and apps within microsoft office 365 and in the meantime you can download these apps by signing in an account for free and install them as an offline microsoft office and use it completely free but this is just for students and everybody is not a student so you can use the other method to edit your data here in the microsoft office i have one drive and then download from now on you can use microsoft office completely free without paying anything and it's completely legal i'm pretty sure you like this video if you did thumbs up and subscribe i'll see you in another video take care bye bye